Due to the 15-year war in Chechnya, terrorist attacks broke out in Russia. One attack was 18 hostages in a Moscow theater, which after three days in Russian, in Russian troops stormed the building, killing all the Chechen rebels and 115 hostages, along with 10 suicide bombings from 2010 to 2004. Two Russian passenger planes are blown up, killing 89 people simultaneously. One of the last attacks was during the tradition Welcome to School ceremony, which had many hostages held in an overcrowded gym for two days, wired with bombs. After Russian troops stormed the school, 200 hostages, including 174 students, died. After these events, President Putin limited democracy, which means it limits civilians' say in the government. Under this rule, the president picks the governors of Russian, Russia's 89 regions, not by electing. Bush was open about how he didn't like this rule, but Obama avoids the situation. In 2008, Medvedev won by the election by a landslide. The United States decided that Russia was cooperating and preventing Iran from receiving nuclear weapons and created a deal that they could buy and trade nuclear weapons between both countries. Obama and Medvedev met in Prague for the first time and agreed to continue this deal. It was passed in December. Many people believe that Putin's pol political party compares to communist Russia, where elections are unfair and television stations are manipulated. Medvedev asked Putin to stay in his administration as prime minister, which had led people to think who was really leading Russia. The growth of the of increasing certain aspects of the economy and government, along with cor corruption of increasing state control, had made foreign investors nervous.